Okay, I've just been joined by Lawrence Clark, who was representing England today over the 110 meter hurdles. He was runner up just behind Will Sharman, and I think um, a new pe personal best of 11, so 13.73. So, obviously, congrats on your performance today, Lawrence. Um, your thoughts on how it went? Well, I got out quite well relatively to what I normally do, but Will was just in front and he held it almost the entire way. Okay. Um, but he's just been in warm weather training with the UK and I've been stuck in exam rooms. So okay. It's been a difficult week, has it? Yeah, yeah, definitely. But I'm glad to come. I had a sort of slight tear in my hamstring on Thursday and the physio sort of touch and go. And so I've come here and I've run a PB in Good. not ideal conditions for me. So. I was going to say, I was going to say it's quite surprising the sprinters who doesn't like the heat. Is that sort of, is that as you always you do? You prefer the cooler conditions? Well, at the moment, I definitely do, because I've been training indoors in Bath, and it hasn't been above 18 degrees, and okay. it's hotter than grease. It's a bit of a change, <laughs> but you're not complaining about the British weather, are you? No, 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 I love it. It's the first time I've been north of Coventry, and there's sun. OK, <laughs> good. It's been a great start, obviously, for the 2010 campaign. Those who perhaps are not aware of Lawrence last year, European junior champion, now he's in there amongst the seniors, took the box title at the beginning of the month last week. 13.74, 13.73 today, so it's all positive, it's all moving forward. What's your thoughts on obviously this summer, what's, what's the sort of plan? Well the aim is, at the moment I'm sort of getting into it because it's my first senior season, but I'm aiming definitely to get into the European team. The qualification is 13.55 and based on, at the moment I'm looking at my senior times in reference to the junior times around last year, um, so this time of season around 13.66, windy, okay. over the juniors, so that equates to about 13.73 if you take it, take away the wind. So. I got down to 13.37 at the end of at, the, at my peak in European Juniors last year, so maybe by the time of the European Seniors this year, 13.3 looks quite quite a good aim. Good, good. How much, say, heart or perhaps belief have you taken from, say, the exploits of Will Sharman last year? Like I say, today you've ran very close and we know he was fourth in Berlin last yeah. year. No Worlds this year, but obviously Europeans and we are expecting that's where the Brits sort of do well. Is, is, you, is it just to get to those championships, or that you strike me as someone extremely confident who can get in amongst it, especially with the seniors and international? Yeah, well, I, I mean, like just racing Will there, he only really had me from the start, and I know if I'm on it, which I'm not really at the moment, I could I could easily take him down. I mean, like the last weekend I ran against Terence Schmel, one of my idols, ran sure. 13, 39, I think, got beaten by Andy Turner. Um, and between, her, between hurdles three and hurdles five, I was coming back at him. I hit hurdle six, but if I can catch up with runners like that, I can certainly catch up with runners like Will, whose asset is the star of the race. Okay, good. So, we shall see. You said, obviously, it's a tough week at the moment, exams. When's it all over? When are you perhaps going to be looking at key races where you're thinking, right, this is where I can really roll? Well, my, my, my first aim is, is to win the National Anti-23s, which is third weekend of June. Yeah. So I finish my exams next week and I can get into it, start doing maybe some races in Europe. Okay. Race some, you know, 13-3 runners, 13-2 runners, see gauge my performances and then come out national championships, hopefully beat Will or Andy, get into the European team, which would be nice. Okay. But it will take a lot of a lot of training. There's a lot a lot more I need to do. I haven't got the stamina at the moment. I just haven't I haven't had the opportunity to get outside and do some long runs. So. Okay. Good so generally it's all looking pretty positive and yeah, yeah. we wish you all the best for the rest of the season Lawrence and hopefully like I say you're on one of those planes for obviously either Barcelona or Delhi. So thanks again for talking Thank to you us. Very much.